Okay guys, it's me Emad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel. So in this video tutorial, we will learn about how to find the RAM usage in our that is uh, used uh, for our WinForm application. So how we can find it out. So for it, uh, first we will go and we will create a new file of ch visual c sharp or ch so we will click on visual ch then on windows then on windows forms application and you can write the name of the project as ram underscore monitor okay or, or anything you want you can write any other name of your own choice now our uh, form has been created form has been created okay and now we will take one push button button is just for the fact that we want to uh, run certain code so we will double click on this push button and here our callback function is okay so whenever we will click the push button all the statements within these two curly braces will get executed okay so now we will add one library or class you can say using system dot diagnostics okay this class is used for to monitor uh, the very internal systems okay and processes they, that are the core part of the cpu we can even uh, monitor them we can e we can take some some bit access okay so now we will write a class that's name is process okay process and we will make an object c c underscore p okay this is the object of that or variable or object of that class process class okay so class system dot diagnostic dot process provides access to local and remote processes and enables you to stop and stop local system processes so with the help of process class we can uh, monitor and stop certain things in processes we will write system dot diagnostics dot process dot current process system dot diagnostics dot process dot get current process okay so okay now dot get current process now dead current process will uh, take what's called is all sort of like um, process which is uh, on runtime that which which we are dealing runtime so now we will uh, write another variable we will create another memory variable that is called as memory usage memory usage which which is of float data type float is a data type which which like which enables this m underscore u to store certain uh, decimal numbers like 2.5 6.5 100 and like this okay current process dot working set 64 working set 64 so we will write current process r r we will just read c underscore p c underscore p it is uh, current process actually dot working set dot working set 64 because we are dealing with 64 bit we are dealing with 64 now this actually memory usage this is our memory usage and usually it is in the form of like bytes and we will convert it into the uh, mbs are megabytes so this cp dot working set four will give us the information about memory usage memory usage now we will print it out on the console so we will write console dot write line m underscore u m underscore u so console dot write line function will print the value on the uh, output okay so but it is in the form of like bytes okay so so we we, we need to divide it with okay wait we, we need to divide it with uh, like 10,000 with one one two three four five six okay six because it is like 30 usually it, it took around 30 okay so now you can see that we got 31 32 uh, MB usage of RAM for our current process means that for our running program so hopefully you got the concept that how you can find the RAM usage for your current 
processor WinForm. So thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe.